Does he have an air back throw? Oh, does he really? Oh! All right, guys. So today we're finally back. We are going to be ranking Street Fighter V throws based off on how much I think they would actually hurt me in real life. Let's just do it. So currently on the top, we got I'm, I'm dead. dead, just like Kanye says. We got the hospital trip. We got it hurts. We got owie. We got that's it. And we got, well, I don't mind, you know, I don't mind. Hopefully I don't use this one too much. Now we're gonna, we're, we're just gonna get started. I think, I think, uh, you know, we get, nobody's got time to waste. So we might as well just get into it. Starting us off, we're just gonna start with Rose and Gil. I asked a bunch of people on YouTube on the, uh, you know, posts and stuff, like, to let me know what the special throws are in this game. Because I'm not trying to miss any. Uh, Rose, I'm pretty sure, does just have two basic throws. And we're not doing command grabs today, we're just gonna do basic throws. So... Let's start with this chick's forward throw. What are we doing? Boom. Now, okay, so I, I need the info on Rose. Does she have, like, psycho power or something like that? She's got the purple energy. Throws you up in the air, slams you. You fly down pretty fast. Boom! Onto your head. Your head bounces off the concrete. Um, yeah, dude, this one definitely hurts. I Going off the rules, like I said in the last one, I feel like if your body bounces off the floor and, and goes up a little bit, you know this hurts. All right? And that's only the first one. She's a psychic? Okay. So psychic energy pulls you up in the air, slams you down. No time to waste. Let's get to the second one. Woo! All right, so this one, she puts her psycho energy, or sorry, psych psychic energy on your head, spins a little bit, throws you down. I think this, well, you know. You know, I we, there's no way to really judge how much this would hurt. I'm not smart enough to figure out, you know. I think if she... Oh, she might be squishing your head. Let's see. Yeah, maybe she's, like, squeezing your head with, like, the psychic... I mean, that would definitely hurt. But the thing is, like, I don't think this increases that crazily, I feel like. Because, like, if we look at... Here, let's look at the... Let's look at our tier list. So let's pull this thing up. So I feel like... Where's Rose? She's right here. So we got... I, I, I kind of just feel like Rose... The way that she's slamming you down. I think if I'm going to be respectful to her... I could give her the hospital trip just because I feel like... I mean, yeah, you, yeah, you're right. Light concussion scenario. But is that hospital trip worthy? You know, like, that's my wonder. Is that hospital trip worthy for a light concussion? I feel like this is probably... Hers is probably pretty light compared to a lot of the other ones. So I don't want to... Even though I think in real life it would hurt. Not in America. <laughs> I, I think... I think even though it would hurt... I think real stuff. We need to give respect to the other people that are going to be on this list. So I'm going to put Rose about right like right here in the middle. Above Owie, you think? Maybe like It Hurts. I can see that. I was going to go either one of these two. I feel like it's got to be either one of these two, you know? I, I, I agree. I think that's fair. I think that's fair. It definitely hurts. It's just not, you know, like a crazy amount. So Gil, if I remember correctly has oh god this isn't street fighter 5 how do i move the how do i move the other person i need like a i need to just plug in a second controller let me get my hitbox let me plug this in ow ow oh my god that was not that okay wow i did not uh i did not make that easy on myself that was stupid you said gills grabs are intense we're about to see if you're right about that all right so forward throw that's not forward throw oh my God, you can hear the cracking, man. That one's insane. Bah, 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 bah. Does he literally say, hear my crack? I don't know what he says. He definitely doesn't say that, but still, bro, cracks your neck like four times. Ah, and this man is like final boss, so I don't know. I think he's insane. I mean, do you see the way his hair stands up on his own? That's final boss material, bro. That's neck snapping? Exactly. Back. Boom! Look at that shit, man. Thinks he's a wrestler. Boom. And on your head, man. Those are always the ones that I feel like look like they hurt the most. Whenever they slam you on the ground with your head first. Ah. Well, I guess it's neck first, but that's after your neck is cracked. Dude, I don't, I don't know what to say about this one other than, wait a minute, is going here, bro. <laughs> I know we're starting off early. We gotta put someone in there. I, I maybe I shouldn't have started with Gil, but like, tell me you're not dead. This man. He's like a godly entity almost. This man is final boss material. He's, he's there's no way 
There's no way this man is not out there to get you. Snaps your neck three times, throws you forward, and he can also slam you on the ground on your neck. He likes to break your neck. And I think Gil's a menace. So he's not doing something unless he's out there to take you out. All right, Kage. Isn't Kage? Kage is like Evil Ryu, right? Tell me he's not Evil Ryu. He's basically Evil Ryu. All right, so I think Kage, if I remember, y'all you you gotta let me know. I'm not too knowledgeable about Street Fighter V. Does he have forward and back throw and that's it? Does he also have a down throw, air throw, stuff like that? I think he just has forward. I'm gonna try it out. Let's go forward throw. Okay, so pretty standard. I think this one, obviously it hurts. But if anything, I'd actually say, I think this is like a more damaging version of Ryu's forward throw. Ryu does that like classic like body bag throw where he slams you on the ground. This looks like that, but he's actually out there to break your back. Like he's actually out there. Boom, bouncing you off the ground with the full intent on breaking your back. All right, so I think that one without a doubt hurts. And you, you probably crack some stuff too. Let's go back throw. Okay. This is another classic like Ryu throw. Throws you back off his foot. I think the kick off your, your chest would probably hurt. And then flying back on your back. Again, she bounces. I think that hurts. I think the forward one looks like it hurts more. He's just, maybe it's just the way that he's doing it, but he looks like he's putting a lot more strength into the first one of like, all right, hold on. You're going to the hospital and I'm sending you. The, the back one is like, get out, you know, just get out of here. So if that's all this man has, let's try it down. No, he doesn't. I don't think he has anything else. Okay. Yeah. I think, I think this is, obviously, I think it hurts. I honestly expected more from Kage. We're going to have to put him a little bit above Rose. I'm with you. You honestly, I totally agree. Because I don't know, man. It's like, I have the thought that maybe you have a hospital trip, but I feel like if Kage wanted to, he would do something even more menacing. Like there's definitely some more menacing stuff he could do to send you there, but he's not doing it. So yeah, I think it hurts. Falk, Falk, Falk. All right, let's go forward throw. Okay, okay. My initial reaction is not like I'm that, you know, I don't think this one's that insane, uh, but I, I need to see it again. So I know that she uses some form of like psycho power. She's like, Ed. stabs you, throws you. You know, actually, now that I'm looking at this one, I think it definitely hurts. Okay, so you're getting burnt by the psycho power. I'm pretty sure that's the effect that it can have on you. It's like a crazy like internal burning effect. On top of that, she spins you on the staff. So that means she stabs you hard enough that it sticks in you. Because how would she throw you around on that without it being inside your chest? So she stabs you hard enough. So you're getting stabbed in the chest. So that's a wound. Psycho power is going in there. I'm, I'm already thinking this is hospital trip. You can't get stabbed, swung around, and then you're just like, all right, I'm chill though, I'm chill. All right, back throw. Same thing, but slams you even harder. And she throws you over. I, I think this one's pretty simple. I think this one's pretty simple. I think we have our first hospital trip. First hospital trip. Yeah, I think, the yeah, that's usually the rule of thumb, right? Is that anything psycho related usually almost always is gonna send you to the hospital. It just depends on like how brutal they are with it because you know, like Akuma, not Akuma, we've seen Bison with some of his throws or supers that like you're done for. Like it's it's past hospital trip, you know? So it just depends on how hard they're trying. And Falk doesn't look like she's trying that hard. She looks like she's trying to like, I'm gonna stab you, you know, I'm gonna shank you, but that's about it, so. Burning through these, no pun intended. Let's go, bro. He's already, you're on, you already know, you already know. All right, Akuma forward throw. Is, I'm pretty sure it's the one where you like, pun, he like does the, the palm and like in your chest, right? All right? This is like a classic. Yeah, this one's classic. All right, grabs you, forward palm. This man is strong enough to destroy, you know, like some of the most powerful characters in the series and giant ass statues. He can fight the gods. This does seem like something that's a little, like, I think on the outside, it kind of looks like it would be hurting less than it actually would. But this is Akuma we're talking about. So I think your ribs, dude, every time I say something, you're literally, your text pops up. Um, it's perfect. Yeah, I'm, I'm spot on, spot on. I think this is already hospital just because this is Akuma. You know, maybe if this was like Luke or somebody like that, I don't think he'd be going for breaking your ribs like that. So maybe they're just pushing you down. I think he's got, he has the sole intent on hurting you. So I think some ribs are gone. You fall on your back. And ribs are really easy to break anyway. All right, back throw. Ooh. All right. So it pushes you back. I think a pretty strong... Dude, any martial artist kicking you... What is that? Like in the neck or your chin? It looks like your neck area like right here. Any like professional... Is that the jaw? That is the jaw. Any professional martial artist kicking you in the jaw 
is going to be pretty rough, right? And then this is Akuma we're talking about. This man is a demon. You see how hard he hit you? You fly back, boom, bounce on your neck and back. Yeah, dude. I kind of I kind of feel like the easy answer would just be like, all right, Akuma's a god. He's like a demon, so anything he would do would kill you, but that logic is lame as shit. I'm just going to say that from the way it looks, I know this man is strong enough to take you out, but I think based off that throw alone, I think you're going to the hospital. I kind of feel like he's before, or I kind of feel like he's, he's after, right? I don't know. Fox looked a little more painful. Third degree burns is a lot worse, in my opinion, than like some ribs, you know? You think it's above? The combo is a rib shatter and a jaw dislocation. You think that's worse than like a stab in the chest? I guess she is stabbing one spot and you're getting burns there. Yeah, I, I think below is fair, right? I, th I think we'll, we'll just say below. We'll just say below. Just, just for now. I mean, it's pretty close anyway. So now let's talk about Alex. Unfortunately, Alex is a command grab character, so I would love to talk about his command grabs, but we can't do that today. Me failing to do a command grab. Oh, God. I'm playing on hitbox. I don't know how to do it. Um, so we're just going to talk about... Does he have an air throw? It's probably a com it's probably like a command grab, right? Because I think we're just going to have to do forward back throw, or if he, and if he has like a down throw, we can do that too. All right, so let's do forward. I think that was forward. Bing bang. Boom! Chop to the neck. Power bomb! <laughs> That's the classic, bro forward throw is a chop to the neck this one i mean okay imagine a buff new york man coming up to you and giving you the chop on the neck that's what just happened all right i think this one hurts without a doubt but i'm not seeing anything broken i'm not seeing anything broken just yet he doesn't have an air throw he has like a dp with kicks oh yeah that's right he has the air yeah yeah, yeah. you're right you're right you're right you're right all right well we'll have to save that for the next one then um, large man chop is correct. So now let's do back throw. Oh, I love this. I love this back throw. This one's so cool. Pulls you. Bop! Little kick, little wrestling move. I like this one a lot. Yeah, I think he sells a lot of this with his movement. You know, he makes it, like, a little cinematic and nice. I think this one hurts for sure, but I think... Well, let's think about it. Let's watch it again. How how hard do you think this man is falling? Because this man is huge, right? Like this is a, this is a this is a chunky man. <laughs> this is a grizzled up guy <laughs> who is flying at you with his body weight and kicking you in the neck, right? You know, like I feel like if this hurts Akuma, then you you're you're taking some massive damage. You know, the first one is just a fun little chop. This is gonna be the one that puts this man wherever he's going, bro. We're thinking hospital for this one, right? I think that's a pretty good guess, right? Hospital. I was thinking somewhere in hospital, but what I wasn't, what I didn't know is where, where are we thinking he should go. That's a real question. We thinking he's in the middle, below Akuma. Yeah, that's fair. Akuma's got two main areas of damage that he's doing to you. Alex has like one. That's pretty bad. But I still think what Akuma's doing, it's multiple hospital trips, you know, compared to Alex's one, which is going to mess you up. But I think everybody's going to mess you up in this game. No, it's still really bad. I mean, look how high this is. This is the second to highest, so it's still bad. All right, so we're going to go um, just start with Rashid's board throw. Bop. Oh, oh, that's, dude, that is fancy. That is fancy looking. I like that. Oh, he has a run in this game too? That's awesome. All right, what do we think about Rashid's board throw? Boom. Where does he kick you on that second kick? Kick up. Boom. In the back of your neck, it looks like. And you fly pretty far. Yeah, I think this one's pretty messed up. Uh, let's go back. Let's go back throw. Oh! Oh! Yeah, the fourth throw. I'm liking this one. I think this one already, just from how hard he kicks you and you fly forward, I think this one's hurting pretty bad. But the back throw, I think, even hurts. I think this one actually hurts more, bro. Look at that. Look at the kick there, son. Tell me that one's not messed up. On your neck. Bop, bop. Yeah, dude. I don't know. Rashid's pretty strong. I think we have another candidate for a hospital trip. Well, here's the question, y'all. Where do we think he goes? Where are we thinking? Below Alex, maybe above him. I could see that. I could see that. Maybe like somewhere in the middle right here. Back throw. Looks like you're getting sent into a coma for 8 to 18 months. Exactly. This is a hospital trip. Just for that, we'll put him somewhere right here. We might have to change it later, but we're going to put him right there for now. All right, Armika is here. So, yeah, let's, uh, let's, let's forward. Boom! Okay. Little cinematic one. She's got a little wrestling move, trying to show off for sure. Now, the question is, does this really hurt? 
Because I know I, there's some logic I've seen a lot of people use where they say that because a lot of the wrestling characters, like what they like to do is they like to show it off like it's more than what it actually is. I was going off the logic in the last ones that they are doing, like what they're showing off that they're doing, so it actually would hurt a ton. So I'm going to use that logic in this and say that I think Armika is genuinely slamming your face forward into the ground, which would hurt. Absolutely would hurt. I don't think she's faking this. I really do think she's hurting. They got to be doing it, right? I mean, they're in a street fight. Even if you're a wrestler, you got to be doing what you're trying to do because why would you fake it, right? All right, back throw. Real quick, real quick, real quick. Forward throw. That one hurts. Back throw? But forward throw, though. I would mind this. This would fucking hurt. This is hurting, bro. Look at that neck. Ah! RTS said, would not mind. And then Godzilla said, she throws you very far. I have fallen on my back from the same height, and it hurt like hell. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, I think we gotta be consistent. Alright? So I think because her forward throw, I would mind... I can't put her in would not mind, all right? I'd like to give into the funny, ha-ha, horny jokes. But I gotta be a little consistent. I think Armika, me personally, let's see. She slams your neck down on the ground. She throws you far and you land on your chest. Ribs are broken. I think your neck is probably dis- Dude, yeah, this is, this is hospital. I'd say a little bit higher than Alex, personally. That's just me, though. That's just me. She has a crouch throw. Oh shit. Okay. Let's let's do this one. Oh. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. Hold on though. Hold on though. Y'all didn't see this one. Boom. Yeah, dude. This is I think this is the one that hurts even more, man. Straight on your neck. Fucking lifted you up in the air and slams you down on your neck. Yeah. Okay. Guys, I'm sorry. I think she needs to go a little bit higher. I don't know. What do you guys think? Maybe right, right here in the middle. I'm saying either middle or after Akuma. It's gotta be. Middle? Alright, we'll go middle. We'll go middle. And we'll move on. Sean is very weird in this game. I do like how she feels, but her animations are strange, bro. Look at this shit. <laughs> Alright. Let's go forward throw. Forward throw is classic. Everybody knows this throw. It's a little throw you on the ground throw. Fucking bop. Yeah, I love this one. This one's classic. Little spin. Bop. Throw you on your neck. Oh, I don't okay, so I'm gonna be real though. I've always thought this throw is great, but I actually don't understand Why does she feel the need to spin here? Does she really need to spin? Is she using her kung fu to put more like motion into it so she can push like, you know harder or something? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know kung fu, you know, I, I, I don't know so This one looks like it hurts bounce on your back, you know, I think this one definitely hurts There's no debating that well, I think it's really gonna be based off how much her other throws would hurt. She does the spin for style points, exactly. See, that's that's what I figured. That's why John's goaded. All right, back throw. Oh, I actually forgot about that one. All she's doing is pushing Ryu on his back. No, but look how hard she does it though. Boom! He bounces off the ground. Back throw. Bop. Your head. Your head, bro. I'm telling you, this is not a walk away situation. This is not a. Oh, sorry. Uh, excuse me. Uh, you win. I'm out of here. Like, you're... I think Ryu's staying on the ground. You're staying on the ground there. You know? Come on. You're concussed. I think your skull is definitely, like, a little messed up. If you don't go to the hospital for what she just did to you, then you're stupid. So I think she's going to hospital. Look at that! You fly so far! And we need to get the air throw. So I'm gonna try to do that. Oh! <laughs> My god! <laughs> Oh my god, I forgot about this one, man. It's so different. In, in Street Fighter uh, 6, her air throw sucks. It's just the first one, but without the... What? She just like, eh, go to the ground. Dude, look at this shit, bro. Hold on. Ryu, jump. Boom! Okay. Okay. Chun-Li, uh, you're supposed to be a hero. You're acting like a villain. So we gotta put you up there. I think hospital trip... Are we thinking she's in the top? I think I think Chun-Li's at the top. You know, because there's two things that she does that I think puts her up there. And that that last one is just, yeah. That one, if I had to watch all the other ones, I think that's the one that looks like it hurts the most so far in that tier. So, all right, let's get to Ryu. Now, does Ryu have the same throws as uh, Kage? I don't know. We'll have to see. Yeah, he does. He does. I don't know if back throw is the same. Okay, they're exactly the same. Okay. Here's the logic I'm going to use. 
Kage looks like he actually put some oomph in his throw. Ryu looks like he's throwing you like a body bag. Yes, obviously it hurts. But, um... It's not as... It doesn't look like it hurts as much as Kage, you know? I want to give Kage a little bit... I want to give him some points for at least trying. Ryu is out here straight up, not even trying. And honestly, for that, we gotta, we gotta disrespect him, man. Alright, so... I'll put him right here. Alright. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Luke... Ch Luke is here. Alex Lee is here to send you to the grave. What's he doing with that forward throw? All right. Yeah. Yeah. I, you know, I see the vision with this one. Three punches to the head. Coming from, coming from Luke. Look how strong. Look how buff this man is. You see the biceps. That is going straight to your skull. Three times, by the way. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. Yeah, this one hurts. This one absolutely hurts and i think three punches to these same sorry forearms look at his forearms three hits in the same place on your head there's some crack there's got to be a crack there i think you're dumb if you don't go to the hospital and that's from just his forward throw all right back through time all right boom yeah okay look this one's classic i hate this one because it looks like it hurts so much the knee oh your teeth are broken bro the knee to the mouth like you know teeth are falling out and then he decides to knee you again, bro. Why? What is with Luke and the repeated hits, man? Now I know I rated Luke pretty low the first time I did this throw tier list, but I have become a changed man. I now realize that this shit would fucking hurt. So Luke is going up there, hospital trip, and I think he's above Kuma, me personally, because, bro, the same place, your whole face. Okay, so like if you could picture any place, the worst place to get hurt on your body is always going to be a head injury. Or, obviously, your neck. But, like, a head injury is almost always the worst place, right? So, come on. In your face, so your teeth are gone. Your nose is probably broken. Like, these are all things that, like, I'm rating off how much I think it hurts, bro. This has to hurt. I'd say one below Akuma. What did Akuma do again? The broken ribs. The broken neck. Oh, yeah, you know what? Okay, just because he, he gets so many different areas, like, so many different places that you're... Okay, okay, I think that's fair, I think that's fair. I think that's fair. But yeah, still hurts like crazy. Right, let's go back to Dan. Dan will not shut the f*** up, so we're gonna have to tell him... We're gonna have to show him uh, what it's like. Alright, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. You know, yeah, I, I did just realize that. That is fair, you know. Alright, so forward throw... I didn't even look at this one. Okay, uh, Dan is a joke in the series. You don't even really fall that hard, you can tell, because he doesn't even really bounce off the ground. Look, I think this one could hurt, but I really do think this is one that's just gonna knock the air out of you. Yes, getting the getting the air out of you, like, getting knocked out, even, I've had it happen, it sucks, but again, like, you know, you get back up, so, alright. Okay. Yeah. He, he tries really hard just to even get you over his shoulder. So, yeah, he's using a lot of his force, but I do think that proves how weak this man is. So, just like a normal dude probably throwing you over the back. This hurts, but again, yeah, I, 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 I don't know. I think Dan's going pretty low. I think just to disrespect Dan, bro, he tries so hard. I think that's it, really. That's it? That's all you're doing, Dan? That's the amount of effort you're putting in? Yeah. It's not happening. You're, yeah, bro, you're not Zangief. That's what I'm saying. All right, E-Honda, forward throw. All right. This is exactly... <laughs> Abraham Lincoln invented the choke slam. Correct. That's factual. All right. So I rated E-Honda's, like, tummy press, you know, squeeze pretty low in Street Fighter Six when I talked about his because I thought it was funny. The man is literally giving you a hug twice, and I think it's funny. But look, I get it. This man is strong, all right? I get it. He'd probably break your back or whatever with how hard he's squeezing. You know, but like, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not going to say too much. Let's do back throw. Oh, okay. Look at that throw. Bop! Pretty strong. I think this is another one of those, it looks strong because he's putting more effort in, but you don't even bounce off the ground, so... There's others that I rated, like, pretty low, and you bounce your body off the ground, so... I don't know. I don't think this is actually that crazy. I think the worst that Honda does to you is probably his forward throw. Yeah, he squeezes your back, you know. It would hurt like hell. I don't know if this one would hurt like hell. 
I think the forward would. I think this would definitely hurt like hell. This man is strong enough to probably like break some bones. Maybe you're, maybe knock your spine out. You know, like break break your spine possibly. So that one enough is probably enough to send you there. But I'm gonna put him at the low side. I'm gonna say it's a low side of hospital trip. Let's get it first. I know G's got uh, three throws, so we're gonna we're gonna talk about G. So G's fourth throw. Oh my God! <laughs> little punch in the chest. Ooh, and then the little like shoulder, bro. The close, yeah, the close line, bro. The close line is clean. Punch, bam! Sending you forward. I like this one. This one's nice. This one's nice. Without a doubt, this one hurts. This one's sick. Back throw. Oh <laughs> my God! I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that. Oh my god, son. Stop. Oh. That's seriously Bane, bro. You weren't kidding. Bane literally. Bane from fucking Batman, bro. He literally does that. Oh my god. Ah. Okay. Alright. I have my answer, but I haven't even seen his crouch throw, so let's do that one. Okay, okay, okay. That one's simple. That one's simple. I like that one. That one's clean. Bop! Into your neck. That one's pretty good. Yeah. How easy he lifts up Honda makes me giggle. <laughs> no, look at this. Get him up. Oh, yeah, bro. That does look really ridiculous. Just lift him up there. Why not? He's not that heavy. He's not that heavy. All right. Scarecrow look at motherfucking sumo man. Um... The Bane from Batman would kill you. Alright, so I'm seeing a lot of people think G would kill you. What, what are we thinking? Are we are we satisfied with that? Are we thinking Bane is the next man? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going I'm to I'm go by you guys' judgment on this one. I'm not going to have too much of an opinion on this one. I want to see what you guys think. If Bro can easily lift and Bane him, low man, I'm dead. Alright. Alright. I feel it. I'm with it. I see it twice. I'll go with it. I'm cool with it. I agree. Okay. Soccer forward throw. Let's go. Alright. What does she even do? It's so fast, I can't tell. Spins you, land on your side. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think this one hurts. You bounce off the ground. Boom, boom, boom. Using your force again. Using your own weight against you, it looks like. Pretty impressive. Like, look. Bop! I'll bounce off. Okay, okay. Not bad. This one definitely hurts. This one definitely hurts. Back throw. Alright, this is the classic one that we keep seeing. Dan did the same thing, but Soccer didn't actually have to try. Because uh, she, like, got low to the ground. Boom. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't know. Soccer's a schoolgirl. I think she's strong, clearly. Like, I'm not, she's strong enough to, like, get in the tournament. But, I don't know. What are we thinking? What are we thinking for this one? Oh, she has an air throw? Oh! I didn't know she had an air throw. Boom. Oh, jumping off your head? Okay, this one definitely brings her a little bit higher. Yeah, 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 yeah. This one's good. This one's good. This one's good. Oh, okay. Kicking your head. You're flying down onto the ground on your back. Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely, definitely. So I think the first two throws, they're enough that will knock the air out of you. And look, I've had that happen to me. I think it sucks, but I don't think it's like crazy. But that air throw is pretty. That one's pretty brutal. All right. Let's check. Let's check it one more time. Do we think this is a hospital trip or do we think it hurts? Boom! You're flying back on your back. I think it looks like he lands on his head, right? Yeah, he lands like on his back on his head. All right, I'm not gonna waste too much time with this one. Let's get her up there, bro. All right, what are we thinking with Sakura? Where's everybody looking? We got hospital trip. I'm personally feeling like she's like low hospital trip or like high. It hurts. So, hmm, I don't know. I, I think the four, like the first two aren't that bad. I've seen worse, you know, low it hurts. Yeah, I'm not too stressed about this one. I'm just going to move on. All right, we got Ed. Does Ed have a, no, no, this is Ed. What am I talking about? Let's go forward throw. Buzz off. All right. Punch, boom, uppercut. That one definitely hurts. Yeah, dude, the, the punch in your face that, like, throws you out balance, and then he goes for another one. This is, like, similar to Luke's, I feel like, where Ed's pretty strong, right? And he's gonna do it twice in the same place. Strong enough to make you, like, fly back. Definitely some skull, like, damage, some skull fractures, possibly. Alright. The wind-up is kind of crazy. Like, look at that. Boom! Yeah, this one might even hurt more than Luke's, honestly. Alright, back throw. Excuse me? Excuse me. 
God. All right, this one. Yeah, yeah, we're putting him up there. We're putting him up there. Look at this one. How, who the hell can fucking punch you up that high, bro? Send him up. Slam him down. All right. Very serious. I personally feel like I, I could see Ed, like, probably around here. Anywhere around these, probably. That one looks... That one was crazy. That one was actually crazy. Above Rashid. I'm gonna... I'm gonna put him a little bit... Hmm. Yeah, I guess the truth is with our Mika, she... she Okay, so, like, that's that's the argument that's difficult, right? Is because where I feel like Armika did more damage to your, like, head with her kick. And also uses Psycho Power. But he doesn't use Psycho Power in those throws. So, because he didn't use Psycho Power in these throws, I'm with you. I think I think he's got to go around here. Yeah. All right, forward throw. Ooh, oh! I didn't know about the neck crack at the end there. Ah, dude, just listen to that one. Dude, oh man, I feel like that one's already hospital if you're not already dead. Like, dude. And the back throw slams you. Kick full spin, wind up. Oh man, you're right. And on the back of your neck? Yeah, all right. And that's not even considering the air throw. All right, guys, let's be real. Yeah, I think Jury takes you out. I think she does. Dude, you're done, you're done. All right, let's get the forward throw. All right, similar to a lot of the other people's throws in this game. Wind up, spin, throw you, boom, on your chest. Not a crazy bounce, but yeah, you're getting the, I think you're getting the air knocked out of you, possibly a rib or two, possibly, but let's see, let's see, let's see. Ooh, come on, bro, you can't bring knives into this. Okay, she's... Dude, did she slit... Okay, did she slit your throat with a knife? With a kunai? Bro, I can't... <laughs> bro! Oh my god, bro. The moment you put the knife in and you slit her throat, she's dead. Like, I... What do you want me to say? Alright. Ooh. Okay, this one's uh, kind of like... Uh, what's her name's? This one's not crazy. No, I mean, this one hurts. Without a doubt. She kicks you in the head... But guys, but guys, to use a knife, she slits you. Yeah, no. you know, I just, you know, I just didn't expect it. That's all. She's like a schoolgirl. I didn't want to assume, but yeah, I guess she's just, she, she just, she just does that. So yeah, you're done. So what is Laura? Does Laura? I know Laura's like a command grab character, so we can't use her command grabs today. But I wanted to see if she had like a air throw, but it doesn't look like it. All right, let's do four throw. Ooh, this throw is sick. The animation is just sick. Boom. Bah. All right, I like that one. I like that one. Well, judo spin. Slam on your front. Yep. This one definitely hurts. No debate. Back throw. Oh! Oh, wait, wait, wait. Did she dislocate your arm? She just dislocates it, right? I mean, that's still pretty bad. Yeah, I think she dislocates your arm. Okay. I right, know. Correct me if I'm wrong, but does, does a dislocate of the arm actually send you to the hospital? Or does... Or can you just pop that shit back in? You know? Oh, is it the legs? It's not the arm? Oh, I never saw that. Dude, it's like... Okay, so his arm is up in the air, so that's what I was looking at. It looks like... It looks like she does both. On the leg. Ooh. And you hear the crack, right? Yeah. Alright, well, I, I really don't have much to say other than I think this, this one is a hospital trip. I think this one could be like a low hospital trip. There's gonna be a lot of those on this list. Alright, so Geef is Mr. Grappler himself. Unfortunately, we will not be doing his command grab today. That will be in the next video. So let's just start with this man's fourth row. Ah, oh, man. Why are you... Oh, my God. Look at... Ah. I think this one is, is like, your, your, your ass is destroyed, right? Alright, I'll back throw. Boom. Yeah, this one's classic. This is what he does in Street Fighter 60. Boom, a little wrestling slam on the other side. In the air knocked out of you, possibly a river too. Pretty nice one. All right, crouch throw. Oh, oh, this one's sick. This is one of the better throws I've seen so far today, man. This is like a villain throw. God, that one's fire. Coming from Zangief, slamming your head into the ground like that, man. Yeah, Zangief is acting fucking like a villain today, man. I like it. I like it. This is fire. Boom. Yeah, I mean. This man never...
Misses a gym day. All right. Am I blind, y'all? He's right here. Okay, I see, I see, I see. I think you said the combination would kill. The suplex is nasty. So we have... If Chun Li is at the highest of hospital trip, I think Zangief hurts more. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. He slams you. Zangief is a buff ass dude. Slams your face into the ground, breaks your tailbone. Yeah, I think depending on where you fight this man, especially that last throw where he slams your face into the ground, I think Chun. I think he would definitely hurt more than Chun. We're gonna we're gonna put we're gonna put him at the bottom of I'm dead. All right, we got Kareen. Does Karon does Karone. Does Kareen have a crouch throw? Nash is an air throw? Okay. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. All right, we're going to do four throw. Okay. What is that? Elbow to the chest? Oh. Yeah, that one hurts. That one hurts. Without a doubt. Dude, Kareen's movement's crazy. Fucking pop. All right, this one's pretty far. I like this one. Back throw? Oh, how'd she throw you like that? <laughs> how the fuck did she spin you like that? Okay. Sure. Boom. Right under your back. Uh, sh yeah, dude, I, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I, I think this one obviously hurts, right? Hey, Isaac, how we doing, brother? How we doing? The question is, how did my boy G do? I will show you in a quick second, bro. You will see. So, Kareen knocking the air out of you, possibly ribs, right? Back. Oh, man, this one's kind of hard to see, though. Because it's like, he flips so fast. She ain't strong enough to do that with her tiny ass arms. See, that's what I'm so confused about. I'm like, how the fuck is she able to do this? What is Kareen's super mega spin? All right, look, guys, we're not doing, we're not rating supers, but just because he said it, I gotta see this. Hold on, I haven't seen this one. Oh no, wait, I've seen Punk do this one. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is that, <laughs> bro? What the fuck? turns you into like a windmill? That's crazy. Where are we thinking, Kareen? I'm thinking maybe like high, it hurts, maybe. You guys can tell me what you think. I'm gonna put it there for right now. Boom. Oh. Little slam. Bah. Hmm. Back throw is probably not a good time for you. No, that shit fucking hurts, bro. Forward. Ah, back on the back. Okay, on your. Is it on your neck? Oh, okay, okay, okay. I can see this one hurt. I can see this one hurting. Back throw. Okay, okay. So the guile suplex on top of the fact that he literally snaps your neck. Look at this. He snaps your neck. Alright. Unfortunate. Nash somehow snuck in right right here at the top. But you know. That's how it goes. We gotta be fair. We gotta be reasonable. Alright. Let's do four throw. Oh, yeah, yeah, this, I've seen this one, I've seen this one. This is a classic Ken. Just boom, boom, kick you up in the air. All right. I mean, Ken's pretty strong, right? Knee twice to the face pretty fast. I think this one definitely hurts. It's just he does it so fast, it's kind of hard to see what he's doing. Boom, boom, kick you up in the air. Right on your jaw, you're flying up in the air, you're slamming down. I think this one, without a doubt, hurts. Let's move on. Oh, the classic tumbleweed, baby. Boom. He throws you up pretty high, too. Reuse is fucking weak sauce compared to this, bro. Bah! I think, honestly, the only one that really hurts for Ken is forward, right? You know, knee twice, kick up in the air. I think, realistically, you know, this one would have to hurt. Ken's very fucking strong. But I just don't know if I want to give him, like, too many points, considering his other one was pretty basic. I think it was better than Ryu's. Let's, I'm gonna, I'm gonna compare his based off. Let's see where Ryu is right now. Are we thinking Ken's strong enough to kick, like, your jaw out of place and send you to the hospital? Or are we just thinking he's strong enough to just send you in, like, high it hurts? What are we thinking? I feel like Kakes are just, like, reused but a little bit stronger, basically. I'm, I'm gonna actually put Ken above Kage. I'm gonna do it. Forward throw, baby. She got the air throw, too? Okay, cool. And you said it's funny? We're about to see that shit. Let's go forward. I need to see that again. Little snap. Damn it, bro. For a minute, you almost think, okay, I wouldn't mind. And then immediately she snaps your neck. <laughs> ah! Are you dead there? Wait, 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 wait. Are you already dead from the first one? 
Bro, assassins, I'm telling you, they, they make this, they don't allow this to be fun. They just immediately go, yeah, I killed him. He's dead. No, no, no need to, uh, to fucking rank it. It's already dead. God damn it, Kimmy. All right. Back throw. Ooh. This one's cool. Little pop. Ah, little slam. The back one definitely hurts, but it doesn't really matter because she already kills you in the forward. So let's just look at the air just because. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is that? Little hurricane spin, bro? I wouldn't mind is not wrong, but also like, bro, you're done. You're dead. <laughs> look at that. For like, there's one second of enjoyment there and then you're just, you're done. All right, Cammy is going up here and I think she's above Nash. Because she adds like a little bit more flair to hers, you know? All right. Fourth throw. Ooh, he's got the Gal suplex. I didn't even know that. Why does he scream like that though? That's a little, that's a little over the top. Back throw. Oh, okay. Put some respect on Vega's name, bro. That was kind of clean. Bah! Yeah, I like this one. I agree, though. The, the suplex kind of just doesn't really make any sense. I don't know why he does this. But this back throw, this is fire. This is fire. Yeah. I do wish he had a claw throw or maybe, like, like claw, like, you know, like, scratched you with it or something like that. But maybe that's his air throw. I don't know. But back throw is fire. This shit is clean. The little step on your face and then slam you into your... Oh, yeah. This one definitely hurts. I think just how fast you fly, this one's a hospital trip. Straight on your neck. All right. And he is doing it to kill. Yeah. All right, let's, let's look at the air. Ah, this one's pretty basic. Wouldn't he stab your head? Suplex is not an assassination technique. Oh, I thought he was talking about the back throw. This one looks like you could you could take somebody out with this, but it does seem a little too flashy. They need to make a throw for a no claw, and they didn't want to. Oh, you're so right. Yeah, no, you're right. You're right. Yeah. Boom. Yeah. Okay. Bro, I don't even know what to say. You're going right here. All right. Let's go forward throw. Oh, look at that. See what I'm talking about? Like, this man needs more respect. That throw is fire. That's that's a fucking caveman throw. Wow. That's sick. That's sick. Love that one. Love that one. Dude, I think that one's a hospital trip. Slam on your skull and then kick you. That one's fire. Face plant. Yeah, face plant's fire. Back throw. Oh, that's an Akuma-ass throw, bro. Punch in the chest and throw you dead. Dude, isn't this literally a throw in Tekken? Doesn't Brian do this throw? That shit is fire. I like that. I like that. Dude, Nakali's got some badass throws. Does he have a crouch throw? No, he doesn't. I like these, though. I'm gonna go pretty simple on Nakali. I think I think Nakali's sending you to the hospital. These are sick. I'm gonna say... Maybe somewhere around here. Forward throw for Gile. Alright, the same thing as Nash. So we can't really talk too much about this. Suplex. Suplexes can definitely hurt. Guile's strong. Look at his forearms. But let's move on. Okay, Guile just has fucking mixed, like, rinse and repeat, like, throws. He has nothing original. These would hurt, but I just have no reason to go over them because they're boring. So let's see the air throw. Alright, his Street Fighter 6. Yeah, his Street Fighter 6 throw. Or, you know, it came in, it came in this game first, but, like, you know what I mean. Like, that's the one where I saw it. Yeah. I think this one, uh, this one hurts. I, I can't be, I can't be shitting on him too hard. I mean, he literally throws your neck back to the ground, so... This one clearly hurts, but uh, I don't really want to talk about this one too much because I feel like it's pretty basic. So, does he have an air back throw? Oh, does he really? Oh, fuck. All right. Dude, I felt that one in real life. I was so expecting Giles to fucking suck that that killed me. Ah! All right. Where's Gile? There he is. Above Chun. All right, I think that's fair. I think that's fair. Let's do it. Go. Sorry, Chun. Sorry, Chun. All right. All right. Now, Colleen is one of the only characters I actually do know all of her throws because I used to main this character. So she does have a air forward back. So let's do it. Forward. I always thought she said a bowl of soup with this throw. Back throw. Same thing. Slam you on the ground. She says now fall. I like I like her throws. They're both really similar. They're cool, though. All right. Now let's do the air. Oh! I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind. Personally. That one's sick, dude. That one is actually sick. The air throw to breaking your arm. Ah! Yeah, this one's a hospital trip. 
considering who else we have up here, Colleen, I think she's around, what, like here, maybe? I mean, Alex, but what does Alex do? He does the chop, and then he does the knee in the back. I'm going to put her maybe a little bit below Alex, because that, that, I might actually have to put him above Nikali, actually. That neck kick is actually insane. Let's get uh, Zeku, forward throw. Let's see how a ninja throws. Oh, that one's clean. I like this one. I like this one. Forward throw. Forward throw. Knee up. Punch up. Or grab your neck. Throw you down. I think this one's decently cinematic. I don't think it would hurt a crazy amount, but it does look pretty cool. Zeku's change if you're young as well. Oh, I didn't know that. How do you go young? Oh, damn. Young Zeku looks cool, bro. All right, let's look at both. Ooh, I like this one. He spins you around and throws you. Boom. Onto your back. Definitely knocking the air out of you. Okay. Zeku's grandpa, don't be harsh about him. <laughs> Fourth throw? Oh, that one's cool. That's like the fucking Kareen one. Just makes you spin. Wow. pow Yeah, he doesn't have an air throw. Boom! Fire. I like this one. I think it's another case where you're slamming down and possibly broken rib or something like that. Back throw? Whoa! How are you throwing man like that? Seems like he just has the air throw on Corsica Floyd Punch. Oh, it's a command grab? Okay, I'll show it today. Just because. Just because y'all were already mentioning it, so. But that is a command grab. That is a command grab. I'm not going to judge it based off of that. I'm just going to judge it off these other ones. Uh, I think Zeku has four fucking throws. And this is one of them. So, I think he's a hospital trip. Got any exercise? Put him, like, right here. I'll see Cody. Cody Travers, am I right? All right. So, Cody, is he a, he's not a throw. Cody's all, he's a fucking brawler, bro. Tornado. <laughs> I'm sorry, what is the fucking delivery on that tornado? tornado? Oh, come on, bro. Bro was not trying in the studio when he said that one. Tornado. tornado. All right, let's get the throw. Oh, headbutt. Headbutt's fire. Headbutt into the spin on your back. Okay, okay. Yeah, how does bro just throw windy? What the fuck? What the fuck is that shit? I do like to use a fireball. I never knew Cody had a fireball. I definitely would have played Cody if I didn't him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I didn't mean to do super. What the fuck he does that? Cody is not Rashid. Yeah, why is he doing that? Let's go back throw. Ooh. Knee in the nuts? No, I'm just kidding. That shit is fire, though. I do like that. Man fights like a brawler for sure. Yeah, that's kind of fire, though. I kind of like this one. The final fight characters either sound like toddlers or have the speech pattern of toddlers. I can see it now. Knee twice in the nuts. Oh, look, I know it looks like it's in the chest, but I'm going to say that that looks like nut kick, bro. And then he kicks you. He's a fucking street brawler, right? So I think he's kicking you in the nuts. Bop, bop, boom. What is Cody's walk animation? Oh, that's clean. <laughs> Dude just does an awkward ass. Okay, at first I thought he was like getting ready. And then he just goes, all right, how you doing? He's going to work. This man has got his fucking nine to five. And he's late. He's just, he, he doesn't give a shit though. He's, he's still walking, bro. He sounds like he's at a good fellas. I can see it. All right. We got the right setup now. Let's do it. Oh, he brings out the pipe. Oh, 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 stop. Boom, boom, boom. All right. I'm sorry. What? Ba, 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 ba. That shit is fire. I like that one. You think he has a B trigger? Uh, a crouch? Okay. It looks like just like his forward throw. That shit's fire. I love that forward throw, though. Ba, 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 ba. Let him finish the animation? What do you mean? It keeps going? <laughs> Man. That one's pretty funny, bro. I like that one. I like that one. Where are we thinking Cody's at? Where are we thinking Cody's at? High hospital? The pipe ends you. Really? I think hospital. Below Alex. Really? I hear high and low hospital, so I'm going to go middle. I'm going to say he's like about right here. He's using metal to hit you with leverage. I mean... Where is he hitting you, though? I mean, he's hitting you, on, like, on your back, right? It looks like he's just hitting you on your back. 
I think it's a bunch of broken bones. I don't know. If he was hitting you in the head, I I just I'd agree with you. But I feel like he's hitting you in the back, right? All right. Let's go forward throw. Little bitch slap a few times. This one does not hurt, bro. She's just toying with you. This one is... I mean, it hurts. It's a slap, but like... Mary Poppins. Yeah, why does she sound like that? The back throw could hurt, for sure. Slam on your back. Bah! Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't feel like this one's that crazy. Like, she's just bitch slapping you. Is that really that bad? I don't feel like this one's that bad at all. And then back throw is like... This one hurts, but... <sighs> I, yeah. I, I, I'm, I'm kind of I'm kind of with you on this one. You know, the truth is, though, getting slapped, I would mind, though. I would kind of mind. I don't know. What are we thinking? What are we thinking? Uh, I'm going to say either that's it or I don't mind, y'all. Most it could have is emotional damage points. <laughs> Yeah, no, for real, bro. That is trash. That's that's not a good one. I mean, the other one, she does, like, slam you on your back, but, like, I don't know. Yeah. I know Seth is about to have some world-ending fucking throw, right? Fourth throw. All right, that one's a little disappointing. Back throw. Bro, about to have some world-ending throws. Bro just tosses him. No, what is this shit? Come on. Look, I'm sure this would hurt, but because how disappointing it is, I also feel like Seth is a that's it throw. Check out his standing heavy kick, actually. Ooh. This one is fire. You comp Can you combo after this? Oh, you can. That's sick. I like that. Get the super. Yeah, Seth is cool in this game. Damn! Do B skill throw. Oh, that. Oh! Okay, that one's pretty sick. We might have to save that. Yeah, that's pretty sick. I like that one. I like that one. I think we'll save B trigger for another one because we haven't. Our B skills, we haven't touched on B skill uh, too much. We'll save those in command throws. So, where's Seth? I'm gonna say that's it. I'm gonna say at least more than Poison or Dan, because it's fing Seth. So, alright, let's go, Akira. She has got an air throw, if I remember correctly. Yes, she does. Alright, forward. Here I come. A little punch in the chest. Yeah, this one hurts. This one hurts. Maybe, like. I think if she's strong enough, she could break a rib, but I realistically do think this one's just more like check you, push you out of the way. So maybe, like, knocking the air out of you. Back throw. What is the point of this one? Ah, Akira is really fun in this game. I have, I've seen some Akira stuff. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I don't think these. I think they hurt. You know, I'm not saying they're on like Seth level where they're always disappointing, but like, I think air throw is gonna be our deciding factor. All right, it's just basically a guile air throw. It's just throw you up and yeah, throw you down. Yeah, it hurts. I, I mean, just because she has this one will put her up a higher, but. I was kind of expecting more, man. And because of that, I'll say, like, owie. Maybe she's our first owie. You know? Y'all been talking about M. Bison for a while. Let's get to it. Alright. What what kind of throws does M. Bison have? Let's just do forward throw. Oh! I like this one. I like this one. He does a little Kareen spin, and then he throws psycho energy or psycho power at you. So, you're getting fucking third degree burns on your body, and you're flying. Bah! Yeah, that one's funny. I like this throw. All right, so this one's already a hospital trip. Now let's see back throw. Ooh. You can see his hand. Okay, so he crushes your skull and then throws psycho power at you. Dude, M. Bison might... I, I think we know where M. Bison's going. I think he's right... I think he's like one place away from being in the highest tier, but I still think he's like hospital trip probably. Yeah, above Guile, I agree. Alright, forward throw. Alright, I see the vision. The headbutt. Ah! Slam me onto the ground. That one definitely hurts. Definitely hurts. Birdie is a street thug looking dude. Definitely got the fucking biker jeans and shit like that. 
I think this man has got a pretty thick skull. So, yeah, definitely hurts. Definitely hurts. Back throw? Oh, this, yeah, this, this throw is pretty iconic, bro. Big boy head up, head butt. A chain that spins around you and then throws you. Oh, it kicks you into it. I mean, there's no debating this one hurts. I think I just, I don't care for the animation. And, I mean, it looks like it hurts, but I don't, I don't know. Just send you forward. Uh, Birdie's not bad. I think these one, I think these hurt, but nothing crazy, you know. Y'all have a mom that's crazy. I created the mom. What the f*** are y'all on right now? I'll put him, like, up here, maybe. Nah. Yeah, why not? He's a street thug. I think it hurts. Alright, forward throw. Oh! Twist! That's the Dude, that is the Mick twist right there, man. Back throw. Whoa! I like that one. I actually really like that one. That one's cool. A little spin. That's a pretty unique... Okay, Dalsum's got some pretty unique throws. Oh. Oh, he does a little dive at you, too. I like that one. I like that one. Well, spin. Punch you. Alright. And then the back throw. Throws you pretty far. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see that. I see that. I, st I don't think Dalsum's doing anything crazy. I think, if anything, I'll put him above birdie just because I like the animations more. Put him, like, right here. What does Fong have? Air throw? Doesn't look like it. Does he have a cross throw? We'll just do forward and back for now. God, I hate this character, man. He's so weird. All right. Back throw. Whoa! All right. First one I was about to say was like, yeah, I think this one hurts. Kicks you in your knees hard enough to fly back, which is fucking cool. But back throw is a uh, little spin around. Pop! Pop the back of your knees. And then kicking your head onto the ground. What are we thinking? Is this a low hospital trip? What are we thinking? All right, let's go Fong. I'm going to say it hurts. <laughs> Nothing crazy. All right, fourth throw. I go Balrog. Balrog, Chun-Li, Colleen, all my favorite Street Fighter 5 characters. Bop! Slam you into the ground. This shit is fire. I love this throw. It's so simple, but I don't know. I just love it. Bah! Launch you up in the air. It's just, he's just, he's doing whatever it takes to get the job done. You know, the Mike Tyson style. Just fucking punch you as hard as possible. You're done. Knocked out. Back throw. Oh, nap time. Nap time is fucking iconic, bro. Alright, back throw. I already did it, but I love nap time. Oh, you bounce off the ground, too. I don't know. What do y'all think? You think Balrog's strong enough to fucking punch you, uh, you know. I think your head punches your jaw, right? Punches your jaw up in the air. Oh, no, your chest up in the air. And then punches your jaw onto the ground, bounces off. I'm going to give Balrog some points here. I think he's low hospital because I think your teeth are gone. Oh. This, this, this throw is iconic. Ah! Slam me on the ground like your neck and you bounce back. Fire. Same thing but backwards. Oh, I don't know. Look, 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 look. Look, give this man, I don't know, I kind of like this throw. I feel like it's its a simple suplex, but just the way he does it, bro. I don't know, what do we think of for this one, guys? It's a Batista bomb, lots of spine injury. So, hospital trip. Alright, I'll take your word for it. I'm gonna go, like, right here. Alright, McGill time. I fucking hate this character, bro. I'm sorry, but the flick is crazy. Boom. Oh. Uh, I mean, I do like this one. I like that he just flicks you, bro. Like, the disrespect is fucking fire. And then he... Oh, yeah, I didn't even see full animation. What does he do after? Checks his nails. We're good, we're good, we're good. Yeah, that's pretty fire. Back throw. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! All right. All right, Abigail stepping it up. Slam you onto the ground. Okay. This man is just fucking with you. That's what it feels like. Feels like all of his throws are just, uh, I'm better than you, you know. He can barely jump. That's hilarious. Yeah, I do like his throws a lot. I think this man is so fucking huge that I genuinely think he's, these would have to hurt. But, like, bro, that's just so funny, bro. I think that one, yeah, he steps on your back. I think it was a hospital trip. I think we're gonna put him in a hospital trip. And he's just toying with you, so. He could probably do more damage if he wanted to. 
Oh wait, I never put Balrog up there. Shit. We never, I never, I asked you guys about Balrog. I think Balrog is also a hospital. I think he's a low hospital trip though. Blanca. Wait a minute, wait a, okay, okay, okay. So. <laughs> had to let that one loose, sorry. Um, is Blanca, okay. This is like a similar throw to his in Street Fighter 6, right? It like bites your head. Do we think that Blanca's actually biting chunks out of your face? Do we actually think he's doing that? Because it kind of looks like it. It really does look like he's biting chunks out of your face. Yeah. Alright, back throw. Oh, A little spin, and then he does a Ryu throw? Yeah. Alright, just because of the forward throw, guys, I think we'll give it to him. Hospital trip. And... I think he's higher than Urian. Spine versus face. What would hurt more? I don't know. I, I can't really be the judge of that, so... I'm just gonna put him some here in the middle. That logic, Blanca. I need I, I need him to go up. He's going up. He bites your fucking face off, yeah. Let's go forward. Oh, that's a disrespectful ass throw. Knee you up in the chest and then bah just slam you down. That one hurts. Back throw. Same shit, but he knees you again. Honestly, I'm a little disappointed. I'm a little disappointed. I like the first one. Alright, the first one's cool, right? Like him being like, fuck you, bro. Disrespecting you. That one's cool. But this back throw? Nah. I'm not messing with it. I think they definitely hurt, though. Like, there's no denying a knee to the chest from this guy twice would really hurt. I think ribs, you know? I think low hospital trip, if anything, though. Because he does seem like he's toying with you. Nothing like... He's not, like, trying to kill you. It doesn't look like... So I'm gonna say maybe, like, low hospital trip. Maybe, like, right here. Let's go, let's go. Oh, come on, the f***ing suplex. I do remember this throw, because I don't know what the f*** he says. Veradon or something. Um, damn, Lucy, you're kind of bumming me out. Another suplex. Look, suplex is hurt. I know. But, like, come on, bro. Where's Miku? Right here? Alright, that works. Alright. I'm sure everybody's seen Oro a billion times. I know I have. Well, God, me and Street Fighter 5 was watching Brian F play him, so absolutely, I, I love Oro. Forward throw. Bah! Little elbow check. I mean, elbow to your f***ing dome. Yeah, 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 yeah. And this dude is, like, canonically one of the strongest characters, right? The guy who babysit my grandpa. <laughs> this man is a million years old. Back throw. That's a classic. Throw you up in the air. A bunch of people keep doing that, yeah. I, this one's fine. I think, really, the selling point here is the forward throw. Because <laughs> elbow to the head. I do think Aura is pretty f***ing, like, overpowered canonically, right? Is an air throw? Oh, it does. Ooh! Okay, okay. I think we're seeing hospital trip. Look at that. Ah! Slam you onto the ground. Yeah. Are we debating this one? Yeah. No, he's definitely he's definitely hospital trip without a doubt. We, uh, dude, almost everybody's hospital trip. All right. We got Oro. Gonna be putting us over here in hospital. I think somewhere near the middle would be fair. Right? Oh, let's see. No, 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 because Rashid's was crazy. He's still not. I'm going to say... I think once we get to a certain point around here where we start putting the characters in the middle, it, it's kind of hard, right? Like, it's kind of hard to decide who's better than who. We'd have to really go through and look at the data. I'd rather just have the viewers tell me how bad of a job I did in the comments. That I'd rather that. Let's do that. All right. All right, let's look at this one again. Throw... I can't... He's so large. I can't really see what she's doing with that first hit. It looks like she's using Rose's uh, magic or her psychic ability to like push you back a little bit with the rope with the uh just like push you back and then kick you you know okay so kick in the chest flying back definitely hurts definitely hurts i could possibly see okay depending on how strong she is a rib is gone right like a rib is broken let's see though let's see let's see what her other uh moves are looking like back throw oh what is that one that one happens so fast i can't really tell jumps on your chest i mean on your head bop boom Okay, so it, honestly, it goes by so fast, I can't tell where she's kicking you with her other foot. Boom! Steps on your head and kicks you down. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I think, if anything, this one would have to be, like, it hurts or a very low hospital trip, right? 
I, I think I might put her hospital just because she stands on your fucking head and kicks you. Yeah, just to be fair. Just to be fair, right? And with that, we have... Holy shit, I didn't even realize. With that, we have finished out our list. We have finished out our list. That was, uh... Damn, I'm already tired. Everybody's villain throws? I'm telling you, bro. Everybody is super violent in Street Fighter V. No kidding. I would love to compare some of these throws with the Street Fighter VI cast throws sometime. Uh, I think that would be a pretty interesting one. No one was in. I wouldn't mind. We'll see. Let's wait for the command grabs. Uh, but yeah, I think that's going to be it, guys. We, 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 we finished it out. Uh, I'm really surprised that it only took two hours. I thought it was going to be taking a lot longer. But I'm going to finish up our record here. Thank you guys for watching this stuff. Appreciate you guys, as always. And that's going to be it. So, peace out.